seven minutes, it just seemed like the guys weren't ready, forcing some plays through neutral zone and that type of thing. And obviously those seven minutes killed you. You couldn't recover from it. Uh, what was happening during that time? They came out with a lot of energy, playing on home ice. Uh, we're making a playoff push, they're making a playoff push. They're coming out a lot more intensity than we did. Um, we didn't keep it simple, obviously. Turn a couple pucks over. But uh, we got to be able to uh, help the guys out. They do make a... Uh, turnover is something we gotta just push to make uh, to help them out as much as possible. And uh, if we give them one quick, we have to just say, hey, like, let's be smart about it. And can't go down three nothing against a team like that. Obviously, pretty good defensively. They're gonna shut it down. I uh, got a good goaltender in that, so we were able to climb out of that hole. And it had to be tough given how well the first shift went and how we got some momentum the first 40 seconds, and all of a sudden it's three nothing. Yeah, if I had the net there, it's a different story probably. It's a game of inches, and that's what happens. It's full 60 minutes. You can't play good for one or two shifts during a period or two minutes out of a five-minute stretch. You have to play four, four and a half, five, hard, strong, or else teams are going to take advantage. It's too much skill in this league. It's, it's too, good of a, too good of a team on the other side of the ice to uh, give up chances like that and opportunities and not be at your best. So uh, obviously not good enough. Your line had a lot of zone time in the game, but the te- as a team, you had 39 shots, but only one goal. Why didn't the zone time produce more goals for you? No, we didn't. We weren't able to capitalize on some opportunities. Uh, goal had played well. I think we missed some chances to get to the net as well. But I mean, yeah, I, I really just think we were missing those second chance opportunities. Uh, at the end of six on five, I buried one into his pad uh, with a with some room on the far side there, and uh, just things like that. Just sometimes it just doesn't go your way. Tougher is it when it's it's a turnover on one play and then it's a miscommunication with the bench, but you know Zachary's going off and it's just you know guys not maybe not talking or, or whatnot and, and it's just you know, it's, it's self inflicted stuff. Yeah, I mean it is tough I think, but uh, we just gotta stay positive with each other and uh, just try to pick each other up, especially if it's I mean uh, guys in here, uh, they're they're their own biggest critic and. Um, they take it to heart, especially when they make a mistake. So they were really hard on themselves and uh, trying to pick them up. And I, I think that uh, that line started turning it around and started being better towards the, towards the end of the game and gave us a chance and had some opportunities. So, um, you know, sometimes the self-inflicted wounds are the worst ones, obviously. And I, I, I think we gave them that game and uh, we definitely gave them that lead. And so uh, sometimes you just got to, if you're not feeling great in the first shift, just simple, don't have to do anything too crazy. And um, to try to get get to work and get feeling good. Alex, you guys have been chasing the season essentially for a while. You got back on the edge of this race here. Just how frustrating is it? You've had two chances in this building. You could have really made a dent in things, and you went 0 for 2 here. Yeah, it sucks. Plain and simple, it just sucks, honestly. There's no sugarcoating it. And realistically, you had the chance. I mean, you weren't 10, 12 points out. You had gotten back in this thing. You've had multiple chances. Can't. Win more than three in a row, it's probably not going to be in the playoffs. It's uh, it's tough. We're going to keep pushing. Never know what will happen. It's, I've seen crazier things. and um, So we're going to keep pushing. We're going to move on to Dallas, and we're going to play a good, hard game. And uh, we're going to focus on everything in our in our control and in this locker room and, and move on. But, yeah, no, it, it definitely sucks losing the Red Wings. Um, team you're chasing. Team that we know we've, uh, we've gotten the better of this season before, too. And... Um, we had the chance, I think, to impose our will on them, and we just didn't keep it simple early, and we just got into a hole we couldn't dig ourselves out.